Hi friends, host Eric here is talking to famous people. So one of the phenomena that occurs with talking to famous people is the coming and going of people. Some people stop and back by for a little while, then disappearing for a while, come back by for a little while, disappearing for a while. One person who always had a lot of uh, merit-based status around here was Barry. And he was here for a while, then some of the shit he liked to do was not allowed anymore because it was getting me in trouble. So uh, he was like, well, fuck it then. And he bailed. And that is understandable. And then he stopped back by for now or for longer. Who knows? One never knows talking to fans. People, one of the number one rules of this place is no expectations, no obligations, no stims, no season of stress. So uh, that's interesting to me, though, that he came back by and just to see him back in the room and drop in. His TI bombs all over the place as usual. Uh, it's weird because that's not the, for me, for a lot of people, that represents the beginning of the channel because it's sort of the beginning of the raw room. And there was a group of people, including Lightbulb and Barry, and I don't remember exactly who else was back then, but Taylor and you know, a couple other people who were the original core members of that. I think Kit Kats was amongst that group as well. The people who were who were there for when I took the trip across country and stuff like that. Ken was one of the early adopters. Uh, and a lot of these people are still with us, which is crazy, and still regular contributors. And um, Carolyn, were you there? Oh yeah, you were. You just are so quiet. And Margie was much more active back then. She doesn't seem to like the new platform, but I suspect if she were to give it another shot, she'd probably find it agreeable enough. Uh, LC, yeah. But of course, for me, the beginning of the channel preceded that. There was the, the Zach era, and before that, there was the me randomly trying to get people to, to join GTM when I felt like it. So I put up an announcement saying, hey, talk with me on GTM now. I'd like to interview you, or whatever. I tried all different kinds of ways to get people to come on. Um, Zachary was a big factor in changing the dynamics of the channel so that it was more group oriented because I had originally was trying to do one-on-one -on -one interviews mostly although it didn't work out like that it ended up being a group like this and I tried to incorporate other people's voices more or less more then than I do now frankly and uh with limited success or mixed success so anyway the the, the long and short of this meandering sort of pointless video is that as I get SI built up with talking with famous people for myself, and it's coming up on a couple of years of really active video making and being a channel, it starts to have weight and depth to me that I didn't anticipate and or understand was something that I sought, but that I do seek, which is this sense of having connected with a lot of different people and you know having talking to famous people be a part of their lives and having it be documented for posterity and my big long-term dream for this channel is for it to become magic sky friend so that every bit of this conversation is automatically transcribed by some app tagged out by the app and and uh, put into a database that's cross-indexed in multiple ways so you can have a rad parametric search on it. And you can have all different sort of variables so that the, this magic guy friend will be able to say, well, that's Susie's voice, that's Susie, and that's Eric's voice, that's Eric. And it'll do it like a play, you know, like Eric. No, fuck you! you know, Carolyn, no, fuck you! Right? Um, that, that would be... Oh, heaven, if we could get Magic Sky Friend eventually to manifest. That's the long-term dream for all of humanity, I think, should be Magic Sky Friend. And at least we could start humanity's dream here on Talking with Famous People. All I need is a bunch of people who know how to program shit to make all that stuff I just said for free. Thanks. Don't forget to eat plenty of cheese. And good luck making my dream come true.